All right, y'all. New day. We how this. I just got finished playing some basketball. I guarantee you, there's some bots up there. They, you know, it took me to go to the park for them to come and cut the grass. You know what I'm saying? Grass wolfing like buckwheat. As you can see, you don't see nobody back here yet. They be back here. Um, I wanted. I wanted to speak on the Pastor Dow. Shot first of all. Shout out to Pastor Dow. I know you don't know me. You should know me, cause DB is the best. Gang Stock Simulation is the best channel on YouTube. But anyway, Pastor Dow, we talking about the beef of Pastor Dow versus New Breed. Did y'all hear about it, man? They going at it, man, toe to toe, blow for blow. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, man. Um, I would you can look it up, man, and watch the videos. You know, I, I didn't really, really dig in, deep into it. Maybe, I don't know. I would, I, w I wanted to do a reaction video to it. I didn't even, I only seen one video. I didn't even, see, I didn't even hear New Breed's side of the story, but we already know who New Breed is. Somebody that claimed that they're being gang stalked and don't know nothing about it. Somebody that claimed that they're being gang stalked, but don't have no footage of them being gang stalked. I, I need to see some proof. I need to see some type of evidence. That boy go to the park. Beautiful every day. You know what I mean? I don't watch his videos, but when I did see some of his videos, I never seen him harassed by a police. One of them piggies. No helicopters. No dog stalkers. I was up there just now playing basketball, and they were just hitting me with weapons, man. I'm like, yo, I'm like, where the weapons coming from? You know what I'm saying? Coming from them bots. They got, look, they got the landscapers out there. They got the landscapers out there cutting grass. They must got, they must be equipped with the directed energy weapons on them. Or maybe it's just a cell phone, whatever it is. I don't know how, to, man, there's so much speculation, man. I don't know how they do it. All I know is that once you on directed energy attack, you're going to feel it. You know what I'm saying? You're going to feel it, man. So I know what I have to do when I get back home. I got to do some more cleaning, you know, on the body. For whatever reason, they like to target um, the gut. Because I guess where, you know, that's where, you know, a lot of your organs are, you know, your organs are caged up inside the rib, the rib cage. So they, it's easy to target that area. You know what I'm saying? So it just lets me know that I got some cleaning to do. But yeah, man, as far as uh, the beef, man, um, you just gonna have to go check it out for yourself. <laughs> cause honestly, I, I really, really can't talk to you much about it cause I didn't even do that much homework on it. But I watched one of Pastor Dow's videos and Pastor Dow spoke on it. Is he got beef with he got beef with new breed and somebody else. You know what I mean? So Trust me, somebody gonna be in the comment section tomorrow. Oh yeah, yeah, I heard about it. You know, you know one of them bots gonna be in the comment section. You know what I mean? Somebody else, somebody, it was a lady that was saying, um, you know, you know, it's a, everybody who still wanna be like gang stalking his witchcraft and, and and she was saying that it's impossible for them to do this type of program, these type of rituals without spell work. I'm like, look, listen here, people. You got to understand that this whole world is run off witchcraft. Okay? This whole world, everything is run off of spells. They, they look, the moment you, the moment you turn on your TV, you're in the witchcraft. They're putting you in the trance. They're putting you under mind control. They're putting you under a spell. When you go to school, what do they teach you? They teach you spelling. So you can spell. So you can learn how to spell. We used to write in cursive. We don't write in curses no more. Write in curse. I, I ain't gonna lie. Though. I like cursive. I don't. My cursive has never really been all that great. You know what I'm saying? But the people, the, the ones that do write in cursive, like you know, there's some people out here that got real neat cursive writing. Shout out to you, man. Shout out to you, man. In fact, for those that's out there. 
that's still right and cursed up to this day. Keep that trade because <laughs> that's that's something that's obsolete now. We in the day of time right now that this new generation don't know nothing about that. They don't know nothing about no curse of writing. So, like I said, they was teaching us spells, how to spell. When you was in school, when you was in kindergarten, they was teaching you that. How to spell, how to write in cursive when you got in, what, the fifth grade? I don't know. I don't know what, what grade was that when they started teaching that. Sixth grade? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Teaching you how to write in cursive. You know what I mean? So, you gotta, when people be like, oh, man, gang stalking this witchcraft. No. No. Shh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, like, come on, man. Like, like you saying, oh, water is wet. No, shh. We know that. This is spiritual warfare. No, shh. Come on, man. Tell me something that I don't know. Who in the world don't know water's wet? Who in the world don't know that this is spiritual warfare? Who in the world don't know gang stalking is, 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 is witchcraft and spells? The bees do spells every time, every time when you watch a, um, a source of war. They don't have source wars, but... Any type of BET awards or any type of awards that they have on TV. Now, I mean, they doing spells. They doing rituals right in your face. When they do the Super Bowl, the last Super Bowl that they just had with Sexy Behind, Alicia Keys, him and her and Usher up there getting it on. And had everybody talking about it. Everybody going crazy. Oh, man, he was disrespecting Swiss Beats. Man, it's all orchestrated. They're actors. You know what I'm saying? They got to do what they got to do. She got paid very well. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I wouldn't care as long as she come home with that big fat check if she was mine. Go up there and shake it behind. Come back home with that big fat check. Let's go buy another house with it. In fact, let's go buy some land and get out of America. You know what I'm saying? I guarantee that clown come down here. That clown gonna walk down here. Why? Somebody gonna come down here. Because DB not allowed to be down here by itself. But you gotta understand, y'all. You gotta understand that everything is based upon spells. Witchcraft. They're doing witchcraft on you right now. Witchcraft is your weapon, but you scared of it. They done, they done, they done um, brainwashed you and got you scared of your own self. You scared to touch witchcraft. <laughs> you, you got the Bible in your hand. And then you wonder why you got the beast's foot up your behind. And, and God ain't even helping you. God ain't helping you. God said you better help yourself. <laughs> God said I ain't helping you. You better help your, your, your dang on self. <laughs> I ain't got time. I went down there and I done died for you behind. I ain't going to do everything for you. I done went down there and nailed me to the cross. Now you still want me to help? Look at that big tree over there in the, in the dark. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, man. I be, I be laughing when I be hearing people talking about, I ain't worrying about gang stalking. I'm just going to let God fight my battles. Well, go ahead. Go ahead and see how well that, how well that, 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 uh, that, that do. See how well that take place. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna be getting you're gonna be getting harassed every day. I'm trying to tell you, some of y'all really don't. I've, I'm, I'm really seeing that some of y'all really don't understand how serious this program is. This is a slow kill program. It is a slow torture program. This ain't something to be really, really joking about. This is some serious stuff. You know what I'm saying? This is this is this is an orchestrated deal to get you sent away. They're trying to put you away. They're trying to send you to the morgue or to jail or to a, um, a mental asylum for the rest of your life and drug you up. That's why I told y'all to watch the movie Scanners. Because when you watch the movie Scanners, they show you what they was doing to those people. Because those people that are in the movie Scanners, they, they was gifted, right? They was gifted with uh, telepathy and they know how to do things with their minds. So that's why I say most of us, not all, but most of us TIs that's in this program, including especially myself, I really, really speak on myself, that's in this program, we are gifted with some stuff that we may not be aware of, but the CIA is. 
they know who you are. Even when you watch the movie Jason Part 7. Watch, the, watch Jason Part 7, Jason versus Tina. One of my favorite ones. One of my favorite ones. What was, if y'all remember, y'all may not remember, watch it. What did they do to the girl Tina? They had her, they had her go to, the, to Camp Crystal Lake, right? I'm gonna have to watch this movie again because I ain't seen it in a long time. But they had her go to Camp Crystal Lake, right? And her mother had hooked her up with this fake doctor. He, he was a doctor, but he was a perp. He was a perpetrator. And he was just using her as an, as a, as an experiment. He just wanted to see how well you know, her skills was when it came to moving objects like um, telekinesis and um, starting fires with her mind and stuff like that. He was just he was just documenting her. He wasn't there trying to really help her. He was just experimenting on her. She found that out later as the movie goes on. But she was blessed with certain gifts. So they, you know, they had to keep her away. And it's the same with the movie Brain Scanners, part one, two. I, I don't know about what I said. I did watch one, didn't I? I know two and three. I, I, it's like three. It's like brain. It's brain scanners one, two, and three. I believe I watched all three of them. You know what I'm saying? So these people, aka TIs, they had special gifts. So since they had special gifts, they was wanted by the what? The CIA, the Alphabet um gang. The Alphabet. You can't be out here with no special gifts. You can't be out here jumping like the movies and stuff. Like the movie Jumpers, you can't be, you can't have those type of gifts. You can't be reading people's minds and doing telekinesis and telepathy, and you can start fires and all this fire starters. All these movies that didn't gave us, you know, what I'm saying you got special gifts. So you you go, you got the, you got these special gifts, man. You you dang on right, the beast gonna be on you. If you just a buy, if you just an ordinary dude, you know, what I'm saying they ain't worrying about you. You just got some Nikes on and you want to go play basketball. They ain't worrying about you. You you concerned with LeBron James? They ain't worrying about you. But if you up here trying to do some magical stuff, man, they on you. They on you. They on your behind. They on you like uh, white on rice and flies on shh. You know what I'm saying? So, and you got to be aware of that. This world, this world ain't what you think. <laughs> if you dumb and blue pilled, okay, they'll leave you alone. But if you, if they, if they know your blood type. They got to trust me. They know everybody's blood type now. And they know that we change with, as we get older. So that's why they constantly want to take your blood. That's why they got these plasma centers and stuff like that. Go, come on, donate. Give me your blood so I can give you a couple of dollars, a couple of measly dollars that don't mean nothing. Go ahead, man. Get, let me get that plasma so I can check your DNA and find out who you really are. And I'm going to give you this fiat dollar, which don't really mean nothing. So you can go ahead and buy yourself a pair of Jordans. You see what I'm saying? So you got to look at things like that. If, they, if, they're, if they're offering you money for something that's serious, you got to understand, like, okay, well, what's more important? This plasma? Should I keep this plasma in my body? Or should I go ahead and give it to the beast and, so, and get, and get um, compensated with that, that, that dollar that really don't worth, ain't really worth nothing? You know what I'm saying? It's not backed up by anything, really. You can go get some bread and some, a, a, a bag of weed and, and a beer, and that's it. You know what I'm saying? A pack of tank tops or something. You know what I mean? That's it. But they now they got your DNA. Now they 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 all in your Akashi records, and you don't even know what's going on. They all in your mighty chondria. They know more about you than you know about yourself. You don't know nothing about yourself. That's why you on the channel on my comment section just talking crap because you don't even know who you are. You over here still talking about Jesus died on the cross and all this crazy stuff. You know what I'm saying? They all in your records. They know everything about you. You know what I'm saying? You're like, oh man, he ain't gonna wake up no time soon. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But then it's the ones that they do run. They run it. They run in your um. They run. They they check your your Akashi records, right? And the ones that they they're like, oh, this guy's soon to wake up. With how long? How long? Within like another year, we gotta give him some give him some shots or something. Slow him down. Put him in a gang stock assimilation. We gotta. Turn everybody against them. You know what I'm saying? So this is what they do. They, they set up many traps and snares to 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 um to keep you um you know basically in this virtual prison because that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? Because they know you gotta understand. You gotta ask yourself. It's always deeper than it's more than meets the eye, man. Ain't no way in the world they can be spending all this type of money to keep you down. Come on, man.
Why in the world are they spending all this type of money to keep you down? <laughs> you got you to gotta ask yourself that. How important are you? You got helicopters flying by cops and pigs and land, land bots and NPCs. Everybody tracking you down. Why would they even create a game like this? Why would they even create a, 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 um, a program like this? I believe, honestly, I, honestly, I believe they created this program for the chosen. Can I get a no-no there? I believe they created this joint for us. Because they, they put special people in this program. Everybody ain't in it. Let me go take a walk over here and see if anybody coming. Everybody ain't in this program. You know what I'm saying? You got a whole bunch of conscious people out here, and they're not in the program. They ain't talking about being gang stalked. Anybody coming? <laughs> Who down there? Where your mama at? You know what I'm saying? So I got to cherish the moment. Every time when I get time by myself, I got to cherish this. How much time we got? I said 16 minutes. Okay, I'm going to stop it. I'm going to stop this video. So, yeah, you got to understand that, man. I hope that, you know, my message resonates upon somebody. You know what I'm saying? You got to understand. There's a reason why you on this list. There's a reason. Remember in, in, in the book of Matthews, I'm going to end it with this. In the book of Matthews, when they was when Herod, King Herod was looking for uh, the Savior, they, they knew that it was going to be a, 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 a virgin birth and everything. They knew that the Messiah was coming. They didn't know who it was, right? So they was like, all right, we're going to kill all the babies. <laughs> Every baby that's from two under. They knew the baby was a newborn. It was like, okay, from two under. Kill the baby. They was going around killing all these babies, man. Go ahead, read your Bible, you Mr. Christian guy. Christ, your Christian girl, read the Bible. Don't, don't be looking at me like I got four heads. See, some of y'all be thinking I'm making these stories up. You know what I'm saying? Like, like where do you get that story from? But you profess that you do down with this book and this book and you ain't even reading it. You ain't even studying it. King Herod went down there and started um, um, beheading, killing all the babies because they, they was looking for Jesus. Now, the sad thing about it, hopefully all them babies that got murked Hopefully they was uh, bot babies, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because that's sad that, you know, all them babies had to get murked like that. But as you can see, it didn't, they couldn't find Jesus. He, he made it. So when you protect it, you protect it. And that's, that's just the way it is. And with that being said, y'all, y'all keep your heads up. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. DB out here, nature, call me nature man. Don't call me nature boy. Can I get a hello there, bro smart? Keep your head up, man. The cat down the road is gang stalking. Holla back.